the first match. That's probably why oh, Carlos is playing forward. Here he goes again, Carlos. Third chance. Can he capitalise this time? Yes, he can. Lovely ball forward. Ball. Lovely ball. ball, good movement. Golyatov! Oh, oh yeah, he squeezed it past the goalkeeper. And with that first shot on target, Spartak have leveled things up. And it's the competition's leading scorer who moves on to six now. Well, at the time he scored, he scored all four of Altinordu's goals. Oh, look Great this. run from oh, Grigori. Yeah. That's a penalty. Brilliantly done by the number 18. Weaving away into the penalty area, brought down by Rafa. Competition's top scorer. Oh. Rolls the penalty in, very coolly done indeed to make it 2-1 to Spartak. And Golyatov moves on to seven goals in this tournament. Lovely ball. Carlos is in behind once again. Just trying to get the angle for the shot, still going. Carlos oh. <laughs> has managed to find a way past Boriskin for his second goal of the game. And Real Madrid are back on level terms. Berto's continued his run, stepped through towards Andre. Oh, he might just get there ahead oh, of Frollo. Oh, penalty. Goes down, Carlos oh. scores. Referee allowed play to continue. And Carlos gets his hat-trick. Powers free kick. Oh. Here is Carlos. Oh. And side foots into the bottom corner for his fourth goal of the game. And it really is Kurt turning into a scoring masterclass. Well, the match comes to an end with Real Madrid ending strongly, keeping possession away from Spartak, and the Russians will be disappointed to have lost out again.